We here highly resolve that these dead shall not have died in vain, that this nation under God shall have a new birth of freedom, that government of the people, by the people, for the people, shall not perish from the earth. We can't tell our people they can vote yes on abolishing slavery unless at the same time we can tell them that you're seeking a negotiated peace. It's either the amendment or this Confederate peace. You cannot have both. How many hundreds of thousands have died during your administration? Congress must never declare equal those whom God created unequal. Leave the Constitution alone. We are stepped out upon the world stage now with the fate of human dignity in our hands. Blood's been spilled to afford us this moment now, now, now. Abraham Lincoln has asked us to work with him to accomplish the death of slavery. No one's ever been loved so much by the people. Don't waste that power. This fight is for the United States of America. Do we choose to be born, or we fit it to the times we're born into? Well, I don't know about myself. You may be. This settles the fate for all coming time. Not only of the millions now in bondage, but of unborn millions to come. Shall we stop this bleeding? <laughs>